So if you haven't guessed yet, we really like photography and camera gear here at Adafruit. So we came together to upgrade our DIY slider. So let's check it out. So this is our big upgrade to our mini slider. So it's now motorized using a single NEMA 17 stepper motor driven by the Adafruit Motor Shield on top of an Arduino Uno. The Adafruit Bluefruit SPI friend allows us to remotely control the movement of the camera slider. And with the Adafruit Bluefruit LE Connect mobile app, you can use an Android device or an iOS device to remotely control using Bluetooth. You can put it in all sorts of angles and positions so it does not have to be in a flat surface. And using our smartwatch to control the movement of the slider is actually really convenient. And with the time-lapse feature on the iPhone, it does make taking beautiful shots super easy. But because it is a short slider, you do have to be a bit creative about your composition. So I try to avoid landscapes without foreground elements just so it makes it look like it's actually moving. But having a low profile slider does make it easier to travel with. And when you're scouting for locations, you can just pick it up and set it back down. So once you're done and ready to move out, it's easy to break it down. You can put it in a bag and take it with you wherever you go. So how about those time lapses? So there you have it, a really nice upgrade to our DIY slider. Be sure to tune in next week, we'll take you through the steps of how to build your own. But until then, thank you so much for watching and be sure to subscribe for more 3D printed projects from Adafruit. I'll see you guys next week.